Hello. You may know by this mic that I have either just about to or just did do a show, an episode of the Chase Jarvis Live Show on Create a Live. Welcome. Let me know where you're coming in from as we wait for this to spool up. Um, I'm not talking into this mic, but if you are joining from the broadcast that I just had with Stefan Macchio, then you are psyched because we're going to uh, continue the conversation here for a little bit. I want to welcome uh, Stefan's audience to the show. He is going to be joining us momentarily. Uh, in the meantime, um, love to see Arizona's in the house. Indonesia, Cape Town. Nice. South Africa. Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, Canada. Babin, what's up, my man? How you doing, bud? Uh, well, that was a dope broadcast. Uh, again, if you're just now uh, jumping on the IG and you missed it, um, I had renowned uh, pianist, singer-songwriter Stefan Macchio on the show just a second ago. Uh, he played six or eight tracks off his new album, um, Gangster. So if you missed it live, it's going to be replaying here on uh, on Creative Live TV, on my Facebook page and whatnot. You can check it out. Um, and of course, we're making an audio version. Um, all right, so Stefan's going to be joining us momentarily here. Where are y'all joining? Oh, it was awesomeness, of course. I see that. G Street Studios knows what's up. Chicago's in the house. Yeah, Babin. Um, let's see. There he is. We're going to bring this coming in hot. Going live with Stefan. Where you at, bud? Waiting, waiting. Three, two, one. Yes! <laughs> I'm going to uh, disconnect from our other broadcast because we'll get some uh, feedback if we don't. Here, I'm going to put you down. I'm, I'm right here, Chase. I'm just trying to find it. I just realized I've got to scan here um, to make this happen. Um, I love it. Yeah, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get. Uh, I'm gonna get one right now. It's. Uh, it's. Uh, here, hang on a second. How are you? <laughs> good. Good. It's like it's. Like we have to pretend we haven't been talking for the past ninety minutes. <laughs> now we got again. I don't know if you see these people from all over the world. Boom. We've got. Uh, we already had Africa. Uh, we got Africa, Australia. I haven't seen Asia yet. Africa. We've got some Europe. We got. We have five continents. Let's go. Yeah. Where's Where? Okay. Let's do it. We need, we, need, we need a sixth and a seventh continent here. We need some Asia. And if there is an Antarctica, that would make it complete. Okay. Um, hey, for those of you who missed the broadcast, I thought we'd jump on IG Live. Um, I know, Stefan, your audience is spooling in here right now. Um, congrats on the new album. Thank, and, you. Uh, Thank you. I'll do this. I'll do the selling bit right here. If you have not, um, I, I mean, 16 tracks is that right 16 tracks uh, tales, uh, 16 of solace. tracks, tales of solace um if, if we're dealing with primarily my fans right now um I, it's it's my first piano album in over a decade which is great and um and i'm back at it i know the canadian fans especially the french canadian fans um they've been extremely supportive of me over the last 15 years they love piano music so désolé, je, désolé je, ne, je ne parle pas bien français mais yeah. je sais c'est pour créer des problèmes <laughs> that's all i got man that's, that's... <laughs> but maybe i should uh interview you now chase actually that would probably be more interesting here it's <laughs> no 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 this we, we have to i gotta have do you feel like playing at all or do you want to talk yeah. about the yeah i mean i mean we, we can play uh okay I'm you sure. can you all right you 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 i'll let you turn the tables on me just for 90 seconds because the people are really here for you my man oh i mean you, you know um a lot, here's a here's a song that a lot of the people um, a song called October um, okay. that a lot of my fans always always request me to play we're going to re-release it a bit later down the road um, but here it is it reminds me of uh, beautiful Canadian autumns October Thank you. 
<laughs> a lot of people uh saying that's my song he's playing my song so uh I'm hey just, just huge congrats, congrats on the on the new Ooh. album and um what, where would you steer people who want to uh hear it first what's the best way for them to uh uh either get a sample get a taste or make sure that they get it the day that it comes out the day that it drops uh, August 28th release. Um, and I, I think, you know, Spotify, iTunes, uh, Apple Music, um, you can't go wrong there. And uh, um, I'm going to become more and more active on social media over the next few weeks as we kind of, you know, gear towards that. Um, it, as we discussed earlier in the show, you know, it, it's even being active in social media and you, you kill it. I mean, I was following you on Snapchat like years ago nice. that's <laughs> right that i don't know why this guy gets all this time in the world like he's you're just prolific most prolific guy on snapchat um but you know it's it's uh i just I, i'm releasing music to people i think you know what we didn't talk about in the show it was even the kind of album i wanted to create was you know something that was just like i said that can be on loop ad nauseum and, and you can never get tired of it if that makes any sense well, you covered so much ground musically. I mean, I would even say emotionally, right? Just again, for those who, the tracks, the, the names of some tracks, Fracture, Change, mm -hmm. Sea Change, right. Light, Nostalgia, yes, nostalgia. Solace, like exactly. Time, Passing. Like these are huge themes that, uh, you know, they're one of those themes is always with us at, uh, you know, as we traverse life. So, you know, the the album is I don't I don't know how you could like again that is that is an album for life, right? There's sixteen tracks. Um, I, th I think that's important. No, I think you know, um and as I think for me as the older you get, you would just wanna leave quality work behind. If that makes any sense. Oh, it makes perfect sense. Um, what's so clearly in the process of editing your own work you've got a lot of uh stems and other you know directions that you can take the remnants from this album how much more work do you already have in the can and what's next i mean we, we're already talking about what's next yet your album hasn't even dropped so that's a little bit risky but like clearly you've got uh you're prolific as hell having written i don't know how many grammy noms i don't know how many academy award noms it's all, all, all you look good in a tux by the way some you've had to put a tux on to uh, <laughs> be nominated for some of this stuff um thank you i have a lot of piano music i it's it just comes out of me uh like uh, you know n not all music does but i mean but like i could sit here and like i said play for the next five six hours and likely have an improvised album worth of material. I mean, you know, it's it's it depends on the kind of album. I, I take a lot of time in curating and 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 putting pieces side by side so that they that there's a relationship between them, um, and that there's a story being told. If that makes any sense, mm -hmm. um, uh, you know, I, I love thoughtfulness in art. I love I love things that are well designed. Um, you, you can just pick it up. It's just like it's no different than when you you pick up a great camera. Um, Hasselblad or, or, you, or, or whatever the camera is. And I know that you are a big advocate of your best cameras or whatever one you have. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. But there are just better cameras than others. There are better pianos <laughs> than others. There are better pianists than others, you know, and there are better piano albums than other uh, piano albums. So I think I didn't want to just, just, just do it um, in such a way that um, felt like it was just, I was just like uh, mailing it in. I want, I wanted people to know from right down to the artwork, uh, uh, there was a lot of love put into it. In the same way that when you open up an Apple computer, the way that the box comes, it just, just there's gravitas, there's weight to it. And it just, it just feels really right. And it's, well, it's an experience. And so I can't, I can't uh, echo that sentiment enough. And, you know, rather than trying to duplicate our broadcast that we just uh, spent the last 90 minutes listening to you perform and deconstruct some of the tracks uh, a little bit about your your philosophy on creativity on um taking care of yourself uh if those are ideas or things that interest you i would direct you over to uh, creativelive.com tv or any of my mine or creative lives social social feeds which 
that stuff right. is just it's going to extreme for the next 24 hours and then you'll be able to if you're subscribed to the podcast uh listen to that in its entirety on audio only shortly um but i feel like we just covered some amazing ground over the past 90 minutes and i know you're busy man i know you're you're uh in the middle of getting this album out there um and for those of you who don't know this was like figuring out somewhere between three and four years in the making exactly this stuff on the show so it's crazy. thank you and i i literally i discovered you on the internet and i always tell people like show up in the feeds of the people's uh worlds that you right. want to be in and i saw your name just this, you're the perfect example i saw your name in my feed a bunch of times in a row and saying thoughtful things right and i did exactly what anyone who if right. you were uh, in this sort of creative community in this ecosystem someone pays attention to you you start paying attention to them i looked you up and said holy crap this guy is an amazing musician and started following you and here we are x years later exactly you know you're <laughs> you're on the show i just love that full circle moment and if that's not you know proof in this process that you and i are trying to share with the people who are listening and watching i don't know what is it it's uh it, it really is. God, I have so many stories that I can share that way. And, and I'm, you're now going to be added to that repertoire. Um, a lot of people who know me, and I, I know we got to go here soon, but like when I met Celine Dion for the first time, you know, Chase, you know, I told her, I told her I was a kid. I met her on campus. I said, one day I'm going to write you a hit song. Literally almost 10 years to the day, I ended up writing her comeback song after she takes a sabbatical. Same thing happened when I saw the Winter Olympics in 1988 with David Foster, who was doing the theme. I said, and I was, I was 14, 15 at the time. Um, so emotional. I said, I made a promise to myself. I said, one day I'm going to write the Olympic song when it, the theme, when it comes back to Canada. Next Olympics came back to Canada. Who wrote the oh. theme? Boom. I mean, like a lot, event after event after event. And, 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 and the same thing I said, as soon as I met you uh, through your socials years and years ago, I just knew that you were doing the right thing. You were doing everything that was current and, and ahead still, you know, in a, in a necessary way, um, keeping things moving forward. I said, this guy and I are going to connect at some point and it'll be, it'll be electric. The, and the patience that we both had was hard. Of you course. Know, we were, you know, traveling, uh, professional creators and uh, but it just I'm grateful to be connected and again want to wish you a huge congrats on your new Thank album you. Tales of Solace um, uh, the 28th cannot come too Thank soon you. and I'm, I'm I get the vinyl help me <laughs> secure yeah. the bag yeah, we have we vinyl. have we already I think uh, I, I have I have a pack of them coming soon and, and I'll be yeah. I'll be signing yours I promise uh, it means the world to me. And uh, for those of you who are, if this is the first time you're uh, seeing Stefan, well, you know what to do. Go type him into the internet, Google machine. And uh, just and for uh, Stefan's fans, I want to welcome you to, to my world and say thanks for showing up here. you got to go listen to the show that we just did, uh, creativelive.com slash TV. It's boss. You want to hear some performance. So, man. Taking Chase. up a lot of your time this morning. I want to say thank no, you so likewise. much. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, you're, you're, uh, you're the one who did me a huge favor. I appreciate you so much. No. Um, I forgot to get you my, my – uh, I'll text you my digits. Or wait, how do I do that? Uh, are we connected via Twitter? Is it Twitter I, or DM? What's best for you? I, either one. I think I have them. I, I'll text okay, you right away. Cool. Tell, tell, hit me right back. I think I have everything. Okay, cool. I think I have the right ones. Shoot me a text and I'll text you back. But Okay. Bye, yeah. everybody. Have a thank great you. one. Ciao, ciao. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, Chase. Bye. Bye.